Good afternoon, everybody. <clears throat> Today's problem solve moment is all about that arm runoff as well as maintaining those arm positions on the downswing. So again, there's certain products out there that work on just maintaining the width in the backswing, avoiding the arm runoff, just holding on to that angle coming down. I'm gonna show you a setting that'll do both. This is our TGT arm, and I have it on my trail bicep here with the long training rod. As I get set up, you can see how that training rod's gonna run across my chest. So as I start winding up to the top, and I get to the top of my backswing here, now I've made contact to that training rod. Ultimately, if I get everything too far behind, if I fold too much, I'm gonna bend on the training rod. So I wanna maintain that width, maintain that structure of the trail arm. You might have seen this drill where people get to the top of the backswing, they lay a small training rod or alignment stick across the forearms, and then we try to hold that alignment stick on the way down. Well, with our flexible training rod, we can get this done without dropping sticks or having to have somebody hold it up for you. Now, as I wind up, get that contact, I know I've got good structure here in my backswing. Now I wanna maintain that touch, keeping that trail elbow driving, which keeps that red ball and training rod against my lead bicep. If I get up here and I start dumping it right away, I'm gonna lose it. If I get down here to impact, I'm gonna lose that contact. So to maintain that lag, maintain that structure that you build at the top of your backswing all the way down into that delivery position as we rotate into our impact. So again, this was a problem solve moment all about getting too long in the backswing, not maintaining the width, and then maintaining that structure coming back down. A lot of people struggle with is they do too much back here, causing that casting or throwing on the way down. So what we wanna to try to do is feel where we wanna be. Ultimately, with the flexible rod, you can bend it out more, which now, as you can see, it'll take a little bit longer for me to contact that rod. So depending upon where you want your arm structure, you can adjust all of our training aids to make sure that they're custom fitting exactly what you wanna to try to do. Stop trying to fit into other aids that wanna put you in a position that might not be exactly what you want. Learn like the pros learn. Get into those exact positions. Repeat them as many times as you can correctly using correct feedback and you will accelerate your learning process. For Michael Gish, Total Golf Trainer, Practice Center, Backyard. I hope everybody is having a great week. Uh, we've made it to Tuesday. It's a good start. Now, the rest of the week, DM me, comment. Let me know what you want to see in these live posts. I do these for you guys to show you different ways that I know how to set up the product that can help you. But if you're working on something specific, let me know. I'll make sure to do it just for you. I hope everybody has a great day out there. See you tomorrow.